band is just flaking up over here. I run it about 800 blocks into a mosaic. 67B, uh, 50T right now uh, here in the Western New York band. Good to hear from uh, Good to hear from them uh, this morning. Thank you much for stopping by. Uh, DDR, uh, 6 dr ka 2 aba uh, uh, 73. So we've got a bit of an opening, guys. It's M0YKS in the shack. 17 meter band. 73. Mike Zero, Yankee, Kilo, Sierra. Mike Zero, Yankee, Kilo, Sierra. Mike Zero, Yankee, Kilo, Sierra. Good morning, good evening uh, today. Uh, good, to, uh, good to hear from you. Uh, Bam, uh, getting a little better. So you're up there around the five and four right now here in Western New York. Name is Steve. Uh, go ahead. Yeah, very good afternoon, Steve. Nice to meet you. Good morning to you. And uh, my name is Simon, and I'm uh, in the northern part of England, not far from the city of Bradford here in the county of Yorkshire. Got a very nice copy on you, Steve. You're coming through up to 5'9 on the solids. A little bit of QSB dropping you down to 5.7. Got a bit of noise in the background, but a nice copy on yourself there. And great to hear 17 meters is open. Kilo Alpha 2 Alpha Bravo Alpha. Mike Zero, Yankee Kilo Sierra. Over. Yeah, QSL all on that, Stephen. Well, you're coming through fantastic. I'm hearing you, no problem. And uh, one of the biggest signals on the band for me at the moment there. So excellent on that one. And uh, yeah, sorry to hear about the storms. We've had a lot of rain this side throughout the week and it's raining right now. So we're kind of uh, in a similar situation, uh, but not quite so stormy, just constant rain there. But yeah, I'm running about, uh, about 300 watts into a three element mini beam from an FT1000 Mark V with the amplifier in line there. And lovely to make the contact here on 17. So I'll let you get a few more in the log and keep up the fantastic signals. Hope the band's open every morning. Catch you again, my friend. Kilo Alpha 2 Alpha Bravo Alpha from Mike Zero. Yankee Kilo Sierra. Back to you. Yeah, 73, my friend. Stay safe and healthy. Bye bye. Mike Zero, Yankee, Kilo, Sierra. Yeah, QSL George, very good afternoon from Yorkshire, England. Good morning to you there in Tennessee. Fantastic copy. I've got a bit of QSB, but uh, when the signal's up, it's up to 5 by 9 in the clear and uh, sounding nice and uh, easy to work you there without uh, too many difficulties. My name's Simon, Sierra, India, Mike Oscar, November, and I'm not far from a city called Bradford, just a few miles out in the country, a little place called Bailden on the side of the Pennines. And uh, yeah, great to get 17 metres on uh, the second contact across the pond this afternoon, so I'm uh, really enjoying the opening there. Uh, I'm just running about uh, 250, 300 watts in a small uh, mini beam pointing in your direction, George. So uh, back to you and lovely to meet you for the first time. 
Whiskey 4 United Whiskey from Mike Zero, Yankee Kilo Sierra. Yeah, I'll copy it. Absolutely perfect copy, George. Whiskey 4, United Whiskey, Mike Zero, Yankee, Kilo, Sierra. And uh, yeah, well, first I'll start with the radio. It's the uh, Yesu FT1000 MP Mark V field. And I'm putting out about 20, 30 watts into a uh, Russian um, built uh, double valve amplifier, which is a 2GI set G17Bs uh, ceramic valves, uh, capable of about 500 watts on this band. Uh, our legal limit's 400, so I'm running about 300, just keeping it a little bit under there. And uh, the antenna is the Cushcraft uh, Mike Alpha 5 Bravo, the, M the MA5B mini beam. Uh, it's up at about 20 feet on a, uh, a kind of a, a tripod type of affair, which is permanently fixed uh, with a mast on that. And um, it's, uh, it does quite a good job. We've got it beaming in your direction. I'm, I'm reasonably elevated, uh, between about 550 above sea level is, is the height this side and uh, we're up on the side of the moors uh, overlooking the city of Bradford and uh, yeah it's a terrible week we've had lots of rain non-stop uh, but we're used to it been wet quite a few times high high walking the dogs and uh, also uh, in and out of work there but today I work from home on the Tuesday I, uh, I, I teach welding and fabrication and I do some online theory uh, for my students Tuesdays and uh, it's easy enough to do that in the comfort of the armchair. So I'm quite lucky I've uh, done all that now, just knocked off, and uh, I'm gonna play radio for a, an hour or so. But yeah, we haven't we heard too much, uh, just a couple of US stations, which is co are coming through nice. Uh, you're the second station I've worked today, and there's probably about two or three more of the good signals like coming through on the band at the minute. So uh, it's great to hear 17's opening up, and uh, I love this band anyway, it's always a nice band. They've got a bit of noise coming through, in and amongst, but uh, you're way over all that. Uh, solid 5x9 working really well. And I'm look queue up on the QRZ as well, can see the pictures looking good, very nice views and uh, nice looking shack. And congratulations uh, getting into the uh, CQ magazine. I made it once into the uh, British version, which is Radcom, uh, uh, many years ago for IOTA activation, and that's about it. <laughs> but I do do a lot of internet stuff, so I'm actually videoing this QSO. I'll be putting it on my YouTube channel uh, later on in a, in a short while. So you can check it out for yourself if you uh, follow a link from the QRZ page. So yeah, I'm just running a Heil GM5 studio mic. That's the only thing I've got to mention. And that's the uh, complete rundown of the equipment. There is a few other radios, as there is in any other shack, including your own. Uh, but I won't bother uh, going about all that business. 
I just say I like operating the satellite bands as well. So yeah, I can see the tower with the two beams looking very nice. So back to you, George. Hopefully you're still getting this signal from uh, Bradford, Yorkshire. W4UWM0YKS. Bit of signal fade.
Yeah, Roger George, you just list, lost a little bit there. I'm not sure if you're still copying me, but we had a very deep uh, QSB towards the end of that one. I got uh, most of it. I just had to use my uh, my uh, ears to uh, listen a little bit harder. Uh, but I could hear you, but uh, it was a lot harder than uh, when I first heard you coming in there. So possibly the uh, 17 metre band is changing and uh, we're losing each other. So I won't transmit too long, just in case you're not receiving my signal. Uh, but uh, yeah, hopefully I'll get you again when the band's slightly uh, more reliable but uh, it's absolutely fantastic to uh, hook up for the first time George and check out your uh, page and obviously I know you've checked mine out so appreciate your looking there my friend and uh, unfortunately I wish you best 73 for now and uh, we'll hopefully get you when things are a little bit more reliable there so great to have met you George have a lovely uh, afternoon ahead and uh, keep on the band I'm sure you'll be uh, getting some nice contacts Whiskey 4 United Whiskey from Mike Zero, Yankee Kilo Sierra in the Quebec Sugar Baker. Best 73, my friend. Stay safe and healthy. Back to you. Yeah, many thanks George, 73 my friend, thanks for the great QSO, shame the conditions uh, spoilt the ending there. 73 buddy, enjoy the radio, and this is M0 YKS now clear, bye bye. So that was a bit of a bad ending, QSB, fading signal, but that's what happens sometimes. I can still hear George coming in now, but up and down there, so yeah, yeah. got to try out all the different settings on the FD1000 there. I, uh, I tried the notch filter out first. That did make a bit of difference for a while, and then uh, it didn't seem to do. I changed between the um, the, the digital side, should we say, and the, the basic analog side for the reception filters by pressing that button, which were uh, quite useful at times. And then I used some noise reduction filters, some bandpass filters. I tried every kind of thing that I could possibly think of to enhance the signal. Uh, that's the good thing about these old radios. I've got quite a few nice um, bells and whistles which you can use but they don't always uh, work. So unfortunately, QSB, fading signal, you just gotta try and put your ear to it and uh, pull out what the uh, other guy's saying there. And luckily, uh, the more you do it, obviously the experience you have, and you can easily do it. So catch you later on. This is M0YKS, just making the most of uh, a little opening on 17 meter band. A little bit of rag chewing. Catch you soon, take care, stay safe.